So in the past year and a half uh, we have inhaled and consumed content like never before and mm-hmm. it makes us grin laugh and many times ponder uh, so with the increasing digital penetration in india there seems to be more scope than ever before to exercise exercise our creativity mm-hmm. so what are some of the new challenges that have emerged in the space or uh, have the narrative content is the king changed it's a very interesting question um i, I think it's got two parts to it right uh the first thing that you said is is so much potential for creativity for expression for content to be created right and that brings with itself so much possibility that you've not even thought of what is um uh, what could be put together right what kind of new narratives what kind of new creators what kind of um uh, new stories new characters new settings so much can be created right um and yet we are already feeling like there's too much content already right it feels right. like oh wow everybody is just making content right like i have a now 14 year old nephew who lives in a small town outside nagpur about 150 kilometers from nagpur um and he is making types of pani puri eaters in a little small town called vani there right so everybody is making content what's interesting is that um we are only scratching the surface in this whole game right so this content creation business is only been around for like 5 7 years right only the first set of new companies that are making new media content um or producing for the web have really just about come around right um yeah. so even though the pandemic has feels like it's accelerated everything i think we still have a long way to go um for this whole thing to really settle right um now what do i mean by settle i mean that there should be proof of this being sustainable right uh i speak to creators very regularly on on my podcast and there are some creators who are like the first port of call for them is okay if i make 20 videos or if i make 20 podcast episodes at what point in time do i start making money right and that is that i think is the first big challenge that the ecosystem needs to solve for right uh, whether it's platform companies whether it's talent management agencies whether it is advertisers brands etc everyone is in it for something and the creators are at the bot- at the heart of creating this entire ecosystem right so how do these creators get paid that i think is the biggest challenge uh, that everybody is solving like i said it's only been around a few years so so as we were talking about uh, everybody making content in every nook and corner so speaking of the rise of streaming platforms like tvf dice media which has established an instant connection as a slice of life shows they closely mirror the viewer's life so what according to you are some of the strategies that worked for them in the in terms of entertainment marketing and unlocking new audiences i'll talk about TVF because I've been there. Obviously, I can talk about filter copy right. as well because I've tracked them very closely, right? Um, these two, <coughs> sorry, these two creator brands have really become very sustainable because of their razor sharp focus on the type of content they want to create, right? TVF, while I was there or even now for that matter, TVF focuses on a very specific um, aspiration. in the indian middle class right in the early days of tvf that aspiration was supposed to be indian engineers abhi bhi indian engineers hi hain right tvf makes makes content yeah. for engineer i am an engineer i used to be a tvf fan before i joined tvf i am still a tvf fan um and that's been the focus throughout right how do you tell feel good stories about india that nobody else is telling right ab wo nahi dikh raha hai tv pe ye wala story right there is no story for Um, yes. How old are you, Jay? You're 23. Yes. Right. Um, so uh, I guess that. Oh, wow, oh, wow, amazing. Um, <laughs> right. But there's nothing for you, man, on TV, for example. Right. Sports, sure. But apart from that, where will it go? So that is what TVF latched on to. Right. TVF said, "I'm going to write intelligent stuff focused on a largely neglected part of." um the indian consumer ecosystem right the young smart guy who has seen friends and seinfeld and house of cards now uske liye content nahi tha and that is what tvf has really done well 
the writing is intelligent it is very laser sh- laser focused on a cohort of audience that is underserved and there is constant innovation right and tvf innovates in a very methodical manner filter copy has a slightly different point of view right filter copy uh, believes in reality plus 25% filter copy has made relatable content for a slightly younger generation even younger right maybe 19 to 21 or maybe 17 to 20 maybe that's that's the tg and they make stuff that this generation really latches on right what is this generation looking for they are scattered their attention spans are scattered which is at the listicle format <clears throat> sorry the listicle format really works for filter copy right um and they keep churning out jokes in that really well thought through data driven format um and that's what's work, what works for them right their shows are reality plus 25% and again superb focus right superb focus yes. on these two for both of these finally the one thing that ties them all together is the fact that they have taken risks and put out interesting new talent right that is the biggest thing that all the early digital creators that we've had right whether it's aib or tvf or eic or sng um, or or anyone else right for that matter they gave breaks to new talent and that's super important in a emerging content ecosystem right so what makes a cross functional team efficient and what mindset should fresh mba students have when it comes to working in such a team a oh, great question yaar um i think all teams today are cross functional unless you're especially in uh, in the marketing side of things right you you're always working with either the product side right. or you're working yes. with the sales team or you're working with media teams or or you're working with agency teams like you're working with distributors is it's always a cross functional team right i think the mindset the two things that i will say that are important number one is young professionals should enter with a learning mindset right that unless you're so sure that this is not what i want to do right you should the question you should really be asking is okay what can i learn here that will apply to what i eventually want to do right so young professionals must remember that careers are 25 30 years long at the least right you're not going to win the world in the first 3 years of your career i mean if you can and you have the capability and you have the drive please go ahead and do it right um but otherwise use this time to learn use this time to understand what is it that you want to do and how what you're doing right now will help you grow towards that um the second thing that um uh, in terms of cross functional teams that has really helped me is be a patient listener actively listen okay don't listen because you're waiting for your turn to speak So especially when you're working with people from different parts of your organization cross functional expertise shared goals but different ways of working um uh, listen with the intent to understand um and finally I'm, i'll give you a bonus i said two things but this here's a third uh have the ability to find shared ground right a lot of times especially in meetings and and and, and i'm saying this uh, as someone who who also does this i'm sure right often people are like okay i want to do this i want to do that they were they're saying something where there is common ground but nobody is looking for it so look for common ground between different teams different objectives different constraints and that helps win with these teams right i mean the power of collaboration in this industry at this point in time especially for marketers right if you don't know how to run a collaborative team learn quickly 